Fyodot Alexeyevich Popov. Fyodot Alexeyevich Popov, Russian, also Fyodot Alexeyev, Russian, nicknamed Kolmogorian, Russian, for his place of birth, Kolmogory, date of birth unknown, died between 1648 and 1654, was a Russian explorer who organized the first European expedition through the Bering Strait. He was normally known as Fyodot Alexeyev. Only a few sources call him the son of Popov. He was from Kolmogory and the agent of Alexei Usov who was a member of the Gostinia Sotnya, the highest merchant guild in Moscow. Sometime between 1647 and 1653 Usov petitioned to have Fyodot apprehended on the grounds that Usov had sent him to Siberia with 3,500 rubles worth of goods and he had not reported back for eight years, he went to Siberia in 1639. Moving east, he was at Dumen, Tobolsk, Tomsk, Yenisysk, 1641, and Yakutsk 1642. In 1642 he joined a group of about 100 men under Ivan Rebrov who went down the Lena to the sea and up the Olenyok River to the west. Fyodot had 29 men under him. Two years later they were defeated by the local Tungus and fled down the river. Fyodot and some of his companions sailed east to the Kalima River. When he arrived at Srednekolimsk in 1645 he had 12 men with him and, probably, his Yakut concubine. Hearing of a rich Pogicha river somewhere to the east, he organized an expedition to find it. Since he was not a serviceman, Semyon Desnev was called in as the official leader. In June 1647 he sailed down the river to the Arctic with 50 men and four kashas but they were forced to turn back due to thick ice. Next year they tried again. For a fuller account see Semyon Desnev. Sometime in September he rounded the northeastern tip of Asia and entered the Pacific Ocean. On September 20, 1648, old style, September 30 in our calendar, he was wounded in a fight with the Chukchis. About the 1st of October, OS, a storm separated Fyodot's and Desnev's boats and we lose track of him. In 1653-54 Desnev captured his Yakut woman from the Koryaks. She said that Fyodot died of scurvy, some of his companions were killed by the Koryaks and the rest fled in small boats to an unknown fate. From the location of the woman's capture, it is likely that his boat was wrecked somewhere not far south of an otter estuary. Desnev is usually called the first European to reach the Bering Strait since he was the formal leader and left most of the documents, but Fyodot Alexeyev organized the expedition and may have been more important than the few surviving documents indicate. The Fedotov legend, when, in 1697, Vladimir Atlasov reached Kamchatka, he heard that other Russians had been there first. The natives said that a certain Fedotov and his men had lived on the Nikol River, a tributary to the Kamchatka River, and had married local women. The ruins of their huts could still be seen. The natives thought they were gods or demons and left them alone, but when they saw one Russian kill another, they changed their minds. The Russians were attacked and fled, some going west to the Sea of Okhotsk. All were killed, some by the Kamchatels, some by the Koryaks. So who was Fedotov? There have been four answers, one Gerhard Friedrich Mula thought he was probably Fyodot's son, but offered no evidence. Two Stepan Krashen and Nikov thought he was Fyodot himself and tried to reconcile this with the Yakut woman's story. Other versions of Fedotov equals Fyodot have been tried. Three, he may have been one of the lost men from the Desnev or some other expedition. In Siberia at this time there was a Voska Fedotov, a few people who used Fedotov as a patronymic and various Fedors and so on whose names could have been garbled. 4. He was some other Russian who does not appear in the surviving records. About all we can say is that some Russians reached Kamchatka in the second half of the 17th century and died there. Who they were is a matter of speculation and died there.